Okay. And after the every troop results are ignored. All right. So just doing a little cleanup. Actually, isolated. Oh, your combat strength was halved because you're isolated. So that I would not have support. I would not have needed to support that attack. So that would have been uh, three, six, nine to one right off the bat. So probably could attack both anyway. Um. Being a little safe, being a little cautious. Against those? Well, just across the board. Are you if sure you... about that? Have you seen how deep you've sent your, some of your guys? Oh, yeah, well, I know. I can't <laughs> <That's, laughs> be cautious in some that's, areas. That's not exactly serious. being cautious. <laughs> no, some of the tankers are like, go, just go. So they the, need the roads, too. Those Americans yeah, no. may have been eating some of that Panzer Chocolat. Mm. This stuff is great. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't slept in thirty-eight hours. Yes. I can hear the sun sizzle. <laughs> yeah, I bet you can. <laughs> All right. So combat phase done. Reserve targeted air interdiction. I am not going to do engineering phase. Improved positions. Uh, I'm going to build an improved position with the Brits. So I will spend a support point there. And marker time. Right on Pegasus Bridge. Okay. Bridge engineering. Uh, D6. I forget if I have to roll for this. I probably do. Oh, yeah, I do have to roll. Anyway, yeah, and... Oh, you're kidding. Okay, so much for that. Oh, wait, that bridge, wait a minute. Uh, I have to redo my... The bridge wasn't built yet. I was just moving people all across that bridge as if it wasn't there. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Okay, I gotta redo my moves there. For where? Oh, across the bridge. I thought I forgot that the bridge wasn't... I forgot that the bridge wasn't built yet. <sighs> um... All right. Let me move him back... Jason to the thing. He was over here. Uh, he was up here. That's right. I captured the bridge. It wasn't built yet. Darn it. And a six doesn't let you finish building it? Well, it wasn't even there yet. I was moving guys across as if I had already built it. It's under construction. So that means I can't just cross that river. Oh, I... That's right, these guys were up here because they had taken out... Yeah, because they, cause they, had, they had done the attack. Okay. All right, so in their move, they go to Polab. It's not the end of the world, he says. <sighs> In that case, these guys would have gone here, he would have gone there. 
and they would have done an attack against the Austrian, unsupported, because they got nothing else to do but clear all that. So I need shit. I need a shit for him. Darn it. And then, of course, the bridge doesn't get built, so that's going to really suck. All right, so again, so this illustrates. You see the shit I just pulled for that recon unit? No. You see this thing? It's a, Granted, it's a C unit. Those guys are just like armored cars and guys with rifles and light tanks. And I pulled probably one of the best chits ever. So they have a strength of seven. This is one of those things. And you can't just voluntarily get rid of chits. Like that's something I would have wanted to have on an infantry unit. Instead, it's on my recon unit. Right. That's one of those things that in this game gets a little like, I hope I take enough of a loss where it goes to cadre or give it a replacement point so that I can get rid of that chit and have it go back into the pool. Anyway, I mean, if you're really looking to, you know, take some losses, you can always just do like a half-assed attack across the bridge to one of my guys. Yeah, oh, you mean like around Carrington? I did actually consider that, but yeah, you know, um, just, just send your recon unit down there. Let them soak up all the damage. <laughs> well, I've been telling this recon unit is the best recon unit ever. Apparently, yes. <laughs> These guys found the Panzer chocolate. These guys. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so much for my best laid plans. So, okay, so this is an unsupported attack against your Osh Troop and from these two dudes who had dreams of crossing the bridge until they went, got there and said, uh... There is nope. no bridge. There is no bridge. There is no spoon, Neo. And there's not going to be a bridge next turn either. Oh, that really sucks. Come on, guys. I mean, the engineers. I mean, 82nd Airborne needs your help. I mean, we are talking about, you know, like, the Army Corps of Engineers here. Yeah, I know. <laughs> All right, so I've got four plus one, five plus two is seven. So it's a seven to one right off the bat. In mixed. Uh, seven to one in in Hedra. Ooh. In Hedra. Same thing. Yeah, same thing, seven to one, except it's a little bit more than, than that. So seven to one. Uh, ground support, no. I'm going to fire the naval just because I might as well. So that makes it eight to one. You have no artillery in range, so that's not a problem. Eight to one. Divisional integrity, no. Combined arms, yes. Nine to one. Uh, armor superiority, yes. Uh, I'm max at. I'm at ten to one now. You know, and the head drill comes back down to nine to one. So yeah, nine to one. This should just clean him up. Um, at least I don't have to. Have a regroup guy go to disorganize, which is why why I didn't attack with anybody else. So a six, nine to one in the mix. The six is you lose two steps, you're gone. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a step. Oh, I should take a look. I should take. Let me take another look at that. Oh, actually, was he? He, he was isolated too. So we didn't check this. I I, I glossed over. I kept checking your units, but he was Half not one. I know, I know. It's just like it's just it. It doesn't matter. Um, you're already doing that unsupported. Exactly. I mean, it was just a mop up. So I'm reading section seventeen, which talks about German RP seventeen one three. German RPs may also come from strength steps, which have been eliminated in combat. German player records eliminated tank and non tank steps separately. Whenever a non-tank unit loses a step, the German player records that loss on the army support track using the appropriate German army step loss marker. Whenever a tank step is lost, the player records that loss on the German tank steps and infantry RPs display using the German tank step loss marker. Replacement segment for each six points, the German player subtra subtracts from his accumulated per army non-tank step loss points. He receives one variable RP, and he can do the same thing with tanks. And Research must be lost. So the interesting thing is there's that's right. So some games that I've played, this is the thing about being a war gamer, is everybody throws their own spin. I've seen games that said, well, if the if the step losses are isolated, then you don't count them. 
I guess this game factors in the stragglers would find their way through the lines. And I, the, 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 and that's probably fine. That probably did happen. All right. So the Austroopen is gone. I don't need to take the hex. All right. Um, so again, engineering phase, the bridge did not get fixed. All right. Beach obstructions. Here we go. Is it Vegas? So I need eights now, eight or less. Oh, okay. Because it is June 8th. So Utah makes it. Utah is now fine. Omaha is fine. There's now one. Uh, gold. I guess there's a pl plus one. Oh, no, that's when you do the, the plus one gold beach obstruction. That's when you set the beach obstruction. So, no, I just need an eight. Got it? And Juno. You know. That was the D6, wrong one. Six. Juno is now cleared. All right. Mulberry construction time. Roll one die. I'm going to roll for the U.S. C condition is not rough. Obstruction levels at two, so there's a plus two. No artillery at Omaha, no German unit nearby. I did do the minus two, so that balances out. I just need a five or less. I got it. Okay. Commonwealth. Did not attack the Gold Beach artillery, so... Uh, Gold Beach has a plus one for the... Oh, wait, 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 wait. We got the wrong thing. Sea condition is not rough. Uh, plus one for the obstruction level. Plus one for the artillery is plus two. There's a minus two for the SP. So it's the same thing. Straight up roll. Got it. Hmm. Okay. All right. The depot. The U.S. Uh, U.S. depot modifier is a plus two. Uh, plus one, eh, test, and so yes, I have a plus three. Uh, plus four, plus five, a plus five for the Americans because of your art. I got a clear font today. Plus five. Um, I got a plus five. I need like a, a one or a two. Nope. And roll for the Commonwealth. Same thing. Commonwealth is a plus three. Uh, yeah, Gold Beach. Plus three, so plus four. Artillery plus five, same thing. I, it's a plus five to the roll set. Yeah, that then the depots are are stalled. All right. Didn't get as lucky as last time. All right, disorganization regroup. You're disorganized. Go to regroup, and I remove my my regroup. So I'll let you go first. Let me know when you're ready. I think that was it. You only had those two? Uh, there were three. Three. Uh, I think that was it. Okay. Yeah, everyone else is in good order. So now, for a lot of my units, I have regimental Zox. So that's going to be a plus one to get adjacent to them. Not that it matters a ton, but... I'll race you to Berlin. Okay. <laughs> I think that I got everybody for all that. Didn't move him. That's okay. Okay. Naval sets. All right. German player turn. What's the first step? Supply points? Uh, let's see. Operation phase. Don't have it. Um, uh, yeah, so eight, eight support points, but let's see what the air, what the air has here. Reveal and flip. Hey, no points. I got all eight of them. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Whoa. 
Okay, then. That makes it easy. Uh, replacement segment. Turn play determines how many replacement points he receives this turn. You get zero. Okay. You can, you know, spend your cash in your six for one kind of thing. Um, and you do get your reinforcements. I'm not counting. Oh, well, just come, well, yeah, well, reinforcements come later. So, yes, what's that? So I'm not cashing mm -hmm. in just yet. Not cashing in just yet. Okay. Uh, you can recombine breakdown battalions. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, where to? To the Contenton Peninsula. Okay. The 922nd of the 243rd oh, near Valon will be recombining. Okay. So the 922nd. What's the rule on spacing for them? Because there's another, there's a third right. 922nd just off to the side there. Right, so there are two rules in play. There were a total of six steps there. Yep. For every step above three, because the battalion that you're getting is essentially, it's considered like a three-step unit. Um, so if you cast, so if you, so you don't have to combine three of them, you can combine two of them. Right. So if you combine two of them, you're going to get the regiment there and you're going to get a replacement point. If you do decide to do all three, then you'll get the regiment there and you can get three replacement points. So... The, the the other rule that comes into play as well is if you only do two battalions, mm -hmm. so you have the regiment and that associated battalion nearby. Yeah. When that battalion, let's say, takes losses, you can pull that battalion's steps into the, its parent regiment as as a replacement. Huh. So. I find as the Germans, it's good to just do two of the battalions, get the replacement point, and keep that other battalion to hold the line somewhere. Because otherwise, you're gonna run, you might run out of Zoc. Well, you might run out of Zoc capable units. On the flip side, by doing it all now, you'll have three replacement points that you can just bank. True. So. So you don't lose. So you don't really. Well, you don't really lose anything, but it's there's a bit more flexibility if you only do two. But the thing is, you know, if you need replacement points, let's say in in the con area, then you you also don't have them if you don't do let's say all three. Right. Well. I want to look that up because that's a nuance that I really, as a German player, I don't take advantage of. So this might break down battalion cheat sheet. Yeah, you must recombine using at least two of your breakdown battalions, unless you're the 7th or 9th of the 91st. Okay. Well. Then, uh, that group, the both group sevens will recombine, and I will keep group six standalone. Okay, so here is the regiment. I'll pull there. He gets a regroup, and off he goes. And you can give yourself a replacement point. I'll just add that up in a little bit. Okay. Uh, I'm going to also recombine the 919th of the 709th 919th of the 709th so the 709th is weird in that they only have the one conf group like the 709th didn't even have any kind of regimental integrity and so the 709th conf group is already on board yes it's being oh. He's under, there's a disorganized mark that you probably want to flip under. He's under the 19th Battalion near the AOK. -okay. You guys are AOK. -okay. Oh, yeah. Like right there. Yeah. 
So, yeah, so you already have him on there. So, the, yeah, the rest of the 7 and 9th are battalion only at this point. They have no – these guys really were just weapon you – know, West, you know, the Atlantic Wall mm. units. Okay. Uh, which, is kind of, which is kind of an interesting thing about this game where it's like, yeah, I know you want to, but you can't. They're just not <laughs> that good. And I can't do that. With the. Yeah, what have you got left, actually? You've got one more regiment of the 91st. You've got one more regiment of the 243rd. You've got one more regiment of 352nd. You've got a couple of the 21st Panzer. I've got one more regiment of the 243rd. Yes. Uh, no, yeah, you do. The 920th. Unfortunately for me, there's the one there. The 20th is so far yeah. apart from each other. Yeah, they scattered, yeah. Uh, well, he's the, I the other guy. I would recombine the 1057th of the 91st below Saint Sauveur. Okay. Uh, yeah, cool. So give yourself a replace. That's another replacement point. Two replacement points. Yep. Yeah. I'll get him out for you. I'm also going to... Foster Kemper. Recombine the 916th of the 352nd. I'll do that. Do that. And his 916, dude. And the 916, those are two steps. Versus three. Um, yeah, what happens if it's less? I think the Germans get a freebie. Yeah, essentially it's a freebie. It's not like you have to pay a replacement point or anything. So. Oh, good. Yeah. Okay. I'd, I'd complain, but the Allied battalions, if they take out of the six steps, out of the three battalions, um, if they took one step, so you had five five out of the six, you just get full strength. It's just it's it's a wash. So the same thing happens. All right, so our regrouped. All right, that's it for regroups. Actually, that reminds me, I do have to put the um, divisional integrity under bars on my on my counters. I haven't done that yet. I think you still got what? The one to your 21st Panzer? Although I think your 192nd is too far away. Is it reinforcement time? Uh, yeah, you done with recombining? Yeah, that's it. Oh, okay. Um... Uh, create Panzer Kampfgruppen. You can create the second. Let me get that out of the way. The second SS. A oh, twelfth SS. Got the Mach Four unit. You've got the Recon, and you can grab a. Uh, oh, did you add your two replacement points? I did. Okay. So if you want, you can create the twelfth oh, replacement points. I put steps up. My bad. Oh, okay. Yeah, the replacement points. Now, if you want, points. in order to create a Panzerkampf group, when you need um, a tank, an armor step, you need a mechanized step, so like the recon unit, and one other step. Um, I play that you can use replacement points for this. Instead of grabbing a unit somewhere. Um, although, in theory, what you can do is you can pull a step out of one of the infantry units, like the 716th or something. So what that does, that converts a, like a 216 and a 114 tank with one dot into like a regimental conf group. 
where there's a white dot? Uh, he's got one white and two black dots. Oh. Very good. Yeah, they're pretty decent on defense. Uh, B3s and uh, automatic combined arms. Hmm. I can show you the unit. He's like right there. At the cost of like that. <laughs> well, at the cost of that tank, that recon unit, and I play that you just pull the replacement point out. It says a, a step from somewhere, but the replacement point is essentially a step. So, would you like to convert it? To get regimental? Mm. And yeah. combined arms. Yeah, yeah. I will. Regimental sounds nice. So All right, so which is the... Replacement point. Yeah. Uh, we'll get it's... rid of that um, Mark IV. Yeah. And yeah, you don't want to get rid of the Panther. <laughs> no. no. So which of the two hexes do you want the guy in? Not that it matters a ton. Uh, put him in so he... 3946. Where the tank so, was. Okay. So these guys will go here. I'll get out the chart. Everything's in the chart's too freaking big. And then I put him there. So there you go. And he's under a regroup. Nice. Yeah, those cop group will come in handy. Um, all right, so now the reinforcements. So let's do this. Oh, right. They actually go into the actual box. I keep looking for the, the single map <laughs> off map box. All right, so let me just... You have a ton. Okay, you got two artillery units that go into the holding box. To bring those on board is going to cost you supply points. You've got four units going into S7 and one coming into B12. Now, you can put some of these guys on the railroad. So you've got the other half of the 1050th Regiment of the 77th Division. You've got... Three units of Panzerlair, two tanks, and one mechanized infantry, and you get the 47th Panzer Corps headquarters. So here comes like one of your first headquarters. So let me do this. Let me put this near your Where's your rail? Uh, upper right hand corner. Yeah, you know what it is? It's like this this chart is so freaking big. Do that. So, boom. So, these are your incoming reinforcements. Okay. So, the first guy, the 77th, is coming in on B12. Or, again, he can come in by rail. The other four are coming in to S7. So, S7 is way down by... Le Mans. Yeah. All right, we'll bring him in on rail because he's a five movement. Mm. Uh, the rest. All right, well, let's take a look at what your air is going to be. Uh, 12 and 6 is 18. That's a <laughs> maxed out air assignment for interdiction. Yep. So you're not going to have any die roll modifiers. So at best you roll a one and six, but primary roads aren't one for th or aren't three for one. They're two for one for strat and. Yeah. And the secondaries, if I roll big enough, the secondaries could just be one and not half. Yeah. The secondary roads. Let's see, ally there. On a bold one or two resolve primary roads are treated as secondary roads, and secondary roads cost one during German strat move. So, 
they're not any faster. Right. Hmm. You've got you've got a guy down already in the S seven holding box. And a guy down in S ten. Did did you forget to move those last turn? Uh no, they didn't come in. Oh, they didn't come in. Okay. No, the the roll wasn't good for them. Oh, okay. All right, so these guys are going to go to S7, or are they going to try the rail? Well, all right, what about the roll for rail? Okay, so you'll, you know, it's, it's one die. Mm -hmm. It's a five or less, but... If it's a mech type, there's a plus one to the roll. If right. it's a regiment, if it's a regiment type, it's plus one to the roll. And if I, it's and it's going to be either plus that air unit, or if I get a bold number result, which is almost done in mech, it's a plus one. Let's just assume I get the air unit. So it's going to be a plus one through plus three, possibly. So I am they'll, shutting. They'll just go down to F seven. Okay. All right, so let me do this. Let me. So you do need to, you need to roll what the supply the incoming supply status is. So um, you need to roll a d six. Mm -hmm. To roll high. So yeah, for I didn't the ten last time, which is why my guys didn't come in. Well, they still would have. Well, that's the thing. They still would have been able to come in. This is just a supply status thing. It just affects how fast they they move. Um, so roll for the tank. You need a five or six. Nope, he's out of supply. Of course, because yeah. I can't roll the proper numbers when I need them. Yep, same thing. Five or six. Nope. nope. Uh, three, four, five, six. He's good. Uh, same thing. Headquarters. Three, four, five, six. All right. So all these guys. Of course, the two the two things I really freaking want. Uh, honestly, you want that headquarters. You want to. You need to patch up a line, and you probably need to stop the Americans and stuff from coming down the middle of the board. Yeah, but just the headquarters isn't going to do that. Those tanks are going to be helpful. Right. Well, that mechanized guy is going to be good too. But again, yeah, I'm trying to slow you down big time. Okay. So that is the reinforcements. It'll be the fastest game victory ever. And no, it won't. I don't know about that. You got those deep bad. You got that one tank unit in there, all by him, all by his lonesome, just rolling his way through. Yeah, but I'm also, I'm also going to be isolated. My, I, at some point, there's going to be a case. It's going to be, uh, I can't get past a, a certain point because I still have to get the logistics system up and running, and it's just, I'm about two weeks out, so. I don't have the manpower to do anything about it currently. Yeah, th you could that, be all the way down to like that much is true. Flares by the time I get enough people in to do anything, <laughs> that would be. Uh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. It's a strange game already. Yeah. Uh, art yeah, art no. <laughs> artillery unit released from the holding box. So you have two Nibelwerfer units. In the holding box, but it costs you a support point each to bring them on the map. No, not right now. Not right now. Yeah, that's what I figured. Okay. Uh, German air interdiction. Allied player rolls a die. Here we go. Uh, D6. I rolled oh, a six. I got lucky. Yeah. You did. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> okay, so. Um, so six movement, six points are subtracted for all from all mech units. Yep, so mech interdiction is a six. Non-mech is a one. And primary roads are treated as secondary for strat move. Mm -hmm. And secondary roads are just one. They're just as if it's tactical. Yep. And any bold numbered result increases the cost of movement for German non mech units from one to one and a half in bocage. So you'll, yeah. you don't get you don't you don't get the one 
you know, get the uh, the Bocage bonus for uh, non mech strat move either. So, okay. All right. Well, okay. Eh, it's still a good result. That's why I'm, I'm glad to put max planes in there. Uh, to any effectiveness of allied rail interdiction of German rail capacity. It doesn't happen. It happens HQ later. are considered mech, right? Yes. Okay. So okay, movement. 14 minus 6. Yeah. Ugh. 8. Mm -hmm. All right, so it is your movement phase. Okay. Well, because these are 8s, thankfully it's on the main road, which means they can go at half. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, minus six for the mech. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but it's it's two is one. Right. Oh, I see. Okay, I'm just yeah, trying. To I'm just it. counting by ones. Okay, I thought you were. Okay, yeah, go ahead. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. That main road doesn't go anywhere. I want it to go. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. And same with you. Uh, yeah, you better keep the headquarters with them, yeah. All right, so the out of supply guys. Mm -hmm. Um, It's... Minus six and then halved. Fun. Yeah. It's not Panzer Recon's only move. It only has five movement points. Yes, the Jabos are out. So minus six from fourteen is eight, and then have this four. Mm. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and that's six. Have this three. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> Chris. Uh, this seventeenth SS well, well, guy. Well, the good news is they can trace supply to the forty seventh Panzer Corps, so that's actually not bad. So they're going to stay. They're going to stay out of supply. So there is that. Uh, ten. So that's going to be. At least he can move twenty. That's decent. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. That's not terrible. I mean, it's, it's different. It isn't it different playing on the big map. Yeah, you're like, there's so much space. Yeah, mm. it is. It's... Here come my reinforcements. Yeah, okay. <laughs> They're gonna get to about where they need to be by the time you get to where I think you're gonna stop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's an agreed upon line coming up, so yeah. <laughs> Is there? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. I'm skeptical. <laughs> <laughs> Pardon my skepticism. <laughs> it looks worse than it is. It feels worse than it looks. <laughs> <laughs> and it looks bad. <laughs> Uh, it doesn't feel great. Let's put it that way. <laughs> it's going to take more than a, than a couple of tank battalions to win the war. I'll tell you that right now. The good news is, though, is that those tank battalions are literally by themselves and in the middle of nowhere. Yes. So they're really... They're not currently a threat, but they are. They are. They're making a lot. They're making a lot of French citizens happy right now. But that's all. <laughs> that's all they're doing. It's like a good. It's like a goodwill tour. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, the Germans must have lost. No, no, no. They're just not here right now. <laughs> they're not here. We're we're the rest of you. 
Mm. What do you mean this is it? <laughs> All right, let's bring those real guys in, shall we? Oh, you do that at the end. So you do all your movement first. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, because they don't because they don't move after they do their rail, so just easier. Mm-hmm. Alrighty then. Counts for tactical movement, right? Having that six knocked off, or is that just strat? Oh no, that's everything. Yeah, six is knocked off regardless. Okay. It's very difficult to move around right now. There's just planes everywhere. Yeah, I see that. That need to attack rule, is that only for the Americans and the British? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Well, we'll just move them back. Right, so them and the 125th guys next to them, because they're in clear as well. Oh, I know. Yeah, okay. <laughs> that 120... Uh, I, ooh. I'm going to be filthy. Hey, you can attack. That's there. That is there is that. Mm-hmm. All right, so the interesting thing about that and where uh, my Jaws of Victory modification comes in, what would have happened when you get those three, like my three against your three, mm -hmm. is you would not be able to attack. You, like you would have had to do like three one hex to one hex attacks. Like you couldn't leave my guys on the end of the flanks because they because your guys are also in their zoc. You wouldn't be, you wouldn't be able to just ignore them. Mm -hmm. So you'd have to go like three. I'm not saying one to one attacks, but one hex to one hex attacks, and they tend to be like one to one, two to one things. Right. The jaws of, that's where the jaws of victory thing. Cause you go, okay, I don't have to attack them, but I'm only doing then half strength into. So you can do like three against that one hex, but the guys on the ends are at you know halved because they have to watch their flanks. Right. So it's. There's a term, there's a wargaming term called a soak off attack, and essentially that comes from some early games, like from the 70s and 80s, where, again, if you were in a unit's Zoc, you were forced to attack whether you wanted to or not. Mm -hmm. And so what you would do is you would throw one guy out there so that the rest of the guys can be involved in the real attack. And so the other one would be like, oh, I'm attacking one to four. It's a soak off. I don't care what happens. I just need to be able to attack over here. Like they would force you to attack. Hmm. And I've always hated that rule or those types of rules. I don't think generals, they had fainting attacks, but that occurs below the level of this. Right. I feel. <clears throat> So it looks like you are going to attack. Maybe. There's no maybe about it. Two of those guys have to. <laughs> uh, he's in a town. He's not next to regimental. Uh, he's not next to regimental. Yeah, that's the thing about Mac. Introduction is one, so I can move four. 
Yeah, that's yeah, that's true. Yeah, we can't forget about those. That's that's important too. In some cases, that's like one four, you know, twenty to twenty five percent of your movement capability. And a plus modifier for in and out of the regimental zoc too. With Falchion Jaegers patching up the hole. Well, attempting. Yeah. Yeah, if you're in mixed, you have to as well, not just clear. My one saving grace is I had that paratrooper down there under the uh, supply marker. He's in mixed, but your guy didn't have Zoc because he was disorganized. Oh, so what was that? Well, so the guy's moving yeah, into well. a flooded... Flooded hex. So it's just plus three. Yeah, it's just yeah, it's just three. Yeah, it says three, and then six. Well, and he can't because he right. only has five. Yep. Now, if you're in the city, I don't have to attack you, right? Uh, my Zoc does come out, but you're in hedgerow, so you don't have to attack. If you were in twenty nine thirteen, you would. Ah, uh, okay. Well, that's right. Your Zoc doesn't come out. Right now, the city. If now the city is in clear terrain, but Zocs do not go into a city. So because the Zoc does not go in, I'm not obligated. I think that's how it works. It's kind of I have to. You'd think, well, I'm also in a city, so it doesn't matter. But the Zoc rules for Zoc's not going into a city it has to do with, uh, you can just move in if somebody's on the outskirts. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. All right. I think that's... That's good for that. Um, do my attacks. That's the those are the only two currently. Yep. All right, those are the only two. Okay. All right, pick your poison. Oh, let's hit that solo seventh Canadian. Okay. Um, I am okay. So let's go through ground support. I don't have any artillery. Do you have artillery? I do, and I'm using it. Okay, so you've got a. Uh, is it a fortune? Okay, four shot. It is. I'm in a town, so it's a plus one. Two plus one is three. That's a that's a hit. Okay, I have naval. I will fire and support. That will offset. So now we do the odds. I am defending with three. You have 13, 14, actually 15, because it's in clear. 
So fifteen to three is five to one. Oh, this is yeah, this is questionable. Okay, five to one. This is where. So far, five to one in the clear. Um, divisional integrity, no. Combined arms, yes for you. So six to one. Uh, two dots. Oh, one dot because I have a dot. Um, seven to one. I'm in a town, so six to one. Uh, this is a six to one in the clear. Four is probably four. good. Four is very good. Two uh, DR2. Two DR2. That's it. He's eliminated. And you get to advance too. Hmm. I don't think I am. No, I don't need to advance to that's going to hang me out there. So I'm just going to sit pretty right here. Uh, okay. I, I will advance. I will advance the one into the town. But that is it. Okay. <laughs> Nice attack. I assume that was supported? Yes, that was. So, there's a... Is support point. Yeah, those support points to the Germans are literally like gold. Yeah, well, I'm almost out of gold, so... <laughs> yeah, that's... Gold is rare. Okay, attack on the 6th air landing. All right, let's go through it again. Ground support, no artillery. I don't, I don't have, have that. any more. Okay, I'm gonna try and get the naval. I got it. So I gotta shift in my favor. Okay, I am defending at a five. You are attacking going left to right. You need a two chit for the seven sixteenth, and he's gonna be halved. So that's a three. Three and eleven is fourteen. Fourteen and three. Seventeen. Seventeen and two is nineteen. That's a four to one. Okay. So far it's a four to one. It's a three one because of my artillery. Divisional integrity. You do not have it. Do I have it? Yes, I do. Because on defense, you don't need to be adjacent. You can be within so many hexes. So that's down to a two to one. Combined arms. You have... One combined arms, two combined arms. So that brings it back up to a four to one. Armor superiority, you have one dot, two dots, no dots, five to one. I am in a town, back to four to one. Hedro Bakaj, no, Hilltop River. So it's a four to one in the clear. Okay. <clears throat> Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Throws an 11. That is absolute shit for me. Yes, it is. But you take two steps. Wait a minute. It's four to one in the clear, right? It is. One DR1 so one for me, but a two for you. I got a dash. Where were you seeing the two? Four to one in the clear. Yeah. On an 11. Oh, look at the website. I, I updated the tail. Remember that R2 thing? That yes. was that weird result at, uh, on the four roll? Yes. I fixed that. So if you take a look at that link, I sent it in the Discord chat.
So I changed that R2 to a 1R2, and I, but I had to move the, the 2 result to other oh. things. Well, isn't that just hunky fucking dory? <laughs> Here I am like, oh good, at least I didn't suck at least absolute I did. ass. <laughs> so yeah, just one DR, one to you. So step block to the highest, which would be... I don't even know at this point because everyone else sucks. Uh, the seven sixteenth is a six, and your twenty and your one of your one twenty fifth Italians is a six. So it's the either or. Oh, let's see. Does he lose his dot if he flips? He does. So we're not doing that. Yeah. We're gonna do it live from this guy. Yep. Great. And retreat, and one stack is disorganized. The highest, well, the one with the most units, you have a tie between those two. It's um the stack size, it's not the strength on disorganized. So it can be either of. It was a nice attack, actually. Four to one, you just got. You just got hosed. I, it's your, literally the story of this game and me. It's the story of my life when it comes to this game, apparently, is... Hey, you know that idea you had? <laughs> Good yeah. Luck. I mean, because that could have swung 4-1. That could have swung either way. And that was the thing. I think at around like 3-1 to one or so, it's about... It's actually a little more than 50-50. All right, so those are your two attacks. Yup. Did you pay your support point? Nope. Oh, we didn't do your rail, actually, too. Hmm. Let's see how many guys I don't get. All right, so the 77th guy. Um, oh, I get to redeal and flip and all that redeal. Flippage plus two. So you get plus two. So the 77th, the 1050th, is strictly a plus two. So you need a three or less. All right, wow. so he shows up. So he shows up somewhere at a rail center near you. The 77th guy. Probably where the other 77th dude went. Yeah, he's done at Lisson, which you haven't. Oh, which you didn't. I don't think you moved them. Did you move any of those guys? Or just did you keep them there on purpose? I just kept them there on purpose. Where the hell did I just put that guy? Uh, it's done by Centenny, it looks like. Go west from the other guy. Ah. Uh, yeah, that was super far. Yeah. And so the other guy... Mm. Plus one for regiment, so you need a two. Two or a one or two. Nope. He's of course stuck. Not. He's still going to sit there. Yeah. Okay, so rail movement. You move the units... I determined, oh, I need to roll two dice to try and cut your rail network down. Uh, nope, that did not work. So your rail network that now goes up to a three. Uh, okay, you did combat phase. So done combat. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, engineering. So improved positions. Well, you'd have to pay for them. You don't have any money right now. Any bridges you want to blow? Yeah, I want to continue to attempt to blow that secondary bridge over the Duve. Uh, we, oh, oh. Wait, I couldn't because we didn't have a headquarter nearby. Oh no, you can't. It's just, it's just, it's, it's a long shot roll. There's like a plus modifier to that. So you're talking the one up by uh, Pont Lab? The one underneath my Schnells. The one underneath your schnells. Yep. Yeah, you can roll. You might roll a one or two or something. Let's look it up if you do. Nope. All right. Anywhere else? Oh, uh, yeah. I still need to blow the bridge underneath the 915th of the 352nd. Right. That's a plus modifier, but you might still do it. Four. I'm going to check. That's close enough for a check. Plus three if no supported headquarters. And that supported headquarters is there. Plus one if it's a primary. Yep. 
plus one if either hex the bridge hex that is a part of is not friendly occupied or in friendly zoc it isn't so you just missed you need a three all right and i'm gonna try and blow the bridge at carantan Same thing, I think like a, that Kaboom. one. Kaboom. Kaboomski. Oh, good. All right. Bridge blown. So. Right here. Oh. Oh, fuck's sake, I gotta fix that. Pardon my French. <laughs> All right. Come see, come see. Okay. So, the bridge over Carantan. Yes. Um, which one did you blow? The one to near Carantan? That one there to the right of the city? But where your 84th headquarters was? I just moved it out of the way. No. Oh, was that already blown? It was. Oh, okay. Now I understand. That was already blown. I was trying to blow the one. I see now. I see. Across so. the Duve. Ah. I shall do that. Boom. Yes. Right there. That yeah. one. Yep. And uh, that's all the bridges I can blow right now. I believe that. Yeah, still there. Okay, good. Um, if everybody out of the way. Okay. Yeah, that's all the bridges I can blow. I'm done, done. So disorganization regroup. Your regroups go away. My disorganizations flip. I have a good number of those. Uh, so Deletus. Oh, I didn't move him. Last time. Why didn't I move him? Oh. Delete us. Gotta do a better job. I left that army unit sitting there. Didn't do anything with them. Yeah, 12th SS. Looking a little angry. That's by design. It's all those drugs they take. Yeah. <laughs> it's supposed to look mean. Yeah. Methamphetamine, it's a hell of a drug. Yeah. Don't do meth, kids. Okay. I do believe that's it for that. Oh, hey, of course, and of course, support radius. Oh, I completely messed that up. Okay. Doing too much by memory. Darn it. Oh, actually, oh, so I can kind of do something about that. Okay. All right. We good? Yeah. Okay. Want to do one more?